Well, hello everyone, welcome back to another video. And in this video, what we're going to be doing is we're going to be building this type of platform. What I'm going to start off is by showing you this is how it will be looking, and this is the result you will have. Now, to show you how it looks, let's erase absolutely all the objects that I was building and start absolutely from total scratch. So we're gonna delete this and we're gonna start off. First, I've made some spikes here. I've placed some spikes here and now we're gonna just create an object. Our first object is going to be the X platform. Now, X platform simply means X, sideways, right? Now, let's go into the editor. Now, I have noticed they've installed a new editor, which is pretty cool. So, you'll click on this icon right over here, resize canvas. You'll go to width and make it two. Uh, this is depending on how you, you want your platform, but this is how I want my platform. And I'm quickly going to fill this in with just a random color. We're going to uh, kind of, I, I kind of want dark blue, so let's just, oops. Uh, that was wrong. That was my mistake. So let's just yep. There you go So we're gonna play we're just going to quickly make the platform visible because it's not very visible without these lines Okay, and There you go. Let's quickly just animate this. Oh Man, uh, my bad my bad. Let's just quickly undo. There's an undo button over here and undo again So we'll just click on this Click on this and you're done. Let's click on OK. And let's head over to the behaviors. But before that, let me show you this. In physics, you don't have to touch anything. It will be the way it will be. Now in behaviors, what you need is two always blocks, two number blocks. In properties, you need a velocity block. Then you also need two switch blocks. And then the most important part is two rake as blocks okay so just place those and let's just quickly connect them so let's connect always to cast cast and move this just a tiny bit over always in always in now out get out get x x and select your number my number is going to be three if you're gonna make just follow along what I'm doing because uh, I've through trial and error I found out that this is the best option to you having this click on on and voila now let's click uh, connect the raycast so hit off hit on hit off hit on this is how you'll connect that go to raycast now and uh, before we do this just move over this this is how it will all look this yellow tab doesn't really matter. Okay, so let's go over here and ray length. Um, we can just leave that as it is. But before we just click play, see how it works, let's just make two objects. And they're going to be the block. Leave this as it is, go into behaviors, and use this. Once, oh man, number, I mean number, yeah, I'll delete this, we don't need this. Go to properties and do alpha. Always get. Man, why am I not able to do this? Yeah, just like that. So click on this, click OK, block, and click OK, clone, clone it, place it. Move it over, move it over. Those will be your barriers. Now let's go into the platform itself and let's do raycast block. Raycast, block, and OK. If you don't want to use it, you will encounter a big problem. So I advise that you use a barrier, which is a block. Click OK, and there you go. Hmm. It's not working for some reason. Hmm. OK, so there's just a tiny bit problem here. It is not signaling this at all. Block ray length. Okay, so quickly let's just. Okay, I it does make sense. Okay, on the second ray cast, add 180 degrees. I've messed up. Sorry. Okay, 
So let's just do this. There you go. There you go. And there you go. Okay. So you don't necessarily even have to have this block over here. I'm just covering it. So what you need to do is remember, always raycast, cast zero, stay at zero. If you change this to 180 value, which I will do quickly, it will it will show what will happen. Change it to zero, change that one to 180, you'll encounter problems. So just don't do that. Go to raycast, click zero, click OK, click gray angle, and do instead of 180 degrees on the second raycast block. Now, yep, this is how it works. Very simple and very easy, okay? This is how you create your own platform. The X version, okay? Now, what we're going to do after this is we're going to create a Y platform so that you understand how the Y platform works. I clicked on that icon, click copy, click OK, create Y platform width, width times two. Uh, quickly just do a barrier, oops. And uh, we're going to draw a barrier quickly here. Yeah, just like that. Slowly and carefully make your own type of platform. I'm just making a simple one. Now leave everything at solid. Go to plat uh, code to the behaviors and do paste. Now we're going to unselect. We're going to delete this and we're going to connect it to Y. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to do raycast angle angle 90 for that. And this one's going to be angle 270. Click OK. Click OK. Oh, for, oh I forgot. I need to also clone this block and put it on top. There you go. And boom. Boom. All of this works. Now, if you go to edit, and we see that it didn't quite go with the ground. So let's just make this a little smaller. Ray length a little smaller, 16. And ray cast for this one a little smaller as well. So 16 as well. Okay. Just leave it at that. And we can make the speed even smaller here. So let's knock it down to 2 and put this to negative 2. Now it moves slowly. Now, boom. Boom. Hold. Oh, come on. Yep, there you go. And you've made your own personal block. Now, why are you thinking that the camera is constantly moving? It's because this is from another level and the camera is different, so that's why. But don't, don't, uh, nothing will happen if you don't have that type of camera. Uh, it's, everything, this is how you create your own platform. Do you get it? Understand it? So, yeah, this is how you make your own invincible sideways platform on up and down version. Uh, make sure you follow along everything to the little uh, to the smallest detail rewatch it if you need to make sure to also hit the subscribe button if you have not subscribed yet and uh i'll try to have as much more videos in this year as i can possibly catch up on all right so i'll see you guys in a next future video and this is how it's going to be called and i'm going to have a link down in the description thank you for watching guys